Hello folks, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Persona 3 Blind. Last time we did a half an hour marathon run in the Tartarus, and now we started a new day at school. And lunchtime, Kazushi comes and has a chat with us, so what's up? Yeah, I've been surviving class and Tartarus, although let's not go into that. Sure. <laughs> yeah, uh, I didn't figure that uh, we'd have enough time for a jog at the lunch time. Yeah. Sure, I'll go and uh, have a practice with the kendo team after school. It should still leave me with enough energy for a trip to Tartarus. Oh, crud. Do I really need to stand you up again. Uh, both you guys. The last time I went with you, Kazushi, last time when you phoned me, and uh, yeah, uh, we're just like a minute or two late with your phone call, so this time I'm going to go the other way around. Gourmet game? Huh. <laughs> oh, elitist much uh, with your ramen knowledge. Paulonia War. That's interesting. Okay, and you didn't want to uh, hang out with me anyway, so. And I do have a sandwich, so um, if I head to the mall anytime soon, uh, maybe I'll try and find whoever that person is and throw a sandwich at them. Yeah, let's go. Now I'm just really hoping that this will leave me uh, like pumped up and not tired, <laughs> because I want to go to the Tartarus today. Yep, let's go, that's it. What are you thinking? Huh? What? Wait, what? You are pushing yourself too hard. Oh. That's bad. I actually have uh, asthma myself. But you can work past it. I mean, with decent medication, you can be an athlete even. Actually, one of the uh, greatest swimmers from my country used to be, have uh, asthma. Oh, that was a doorbell ringing, so I'll check who it is and be right back. Well, that was interesting. First time in years I've been tried to get like, converted. I didn't even know those kinds of folks. Uh, still frequented student flats. Never mind. I let them down gently, and now we can get on with this. Yeah. Uh, if you have asthma, you need to figure out. Uh, the decent medication and then try to work past it, like, gently. Uh, there's nothing to apologize for. I mean, it's a freaking physical condition that you can't just get rid of. You can, at most, like, medicate it to, uh, like, um, to be almost noticeable. Uh, I'm... I'm going to be concerned just because, yeah, it's. <laughs> mm. Oh, 
gosh darn it, I mean seriously. You shouldn't do that. Yeah, I'm, I mean seriously, take a day off, do not push yourself. <sighs> yeah, I get it. You you have a you have drive, you want to succeed. <laughs> you shouldn't try to kill yourself to succeed. Keep this a secret, I don't know. Honestly, if anyone who has any kind of medical knowledge at all, a school nurse, a doctor, anyone, asks, I am going to tell. Because, yeah, it's seriously not a good idea to downplay these kinds of uh, unknown injuries. Like, uh, I have a friend who hurt his, uh, bo both of his legs uh, whilst uh, doing the mandatory military service, like, uh, year long. And, uh, yeah, we, uh, there were apparently, like, some minor injuries from marching too much, and he just ignored them and didn't do anything to them. And, uh, yeah, that happened when he was 18. Now he's, like, well close to his 30s and he still has to visit the doctor at least like every half year or so just to check that his legs aren't getting worse it's going to be a lifelong ailment let's have a chat with her I'll go and ask Sure. Hope you have a suggestion in mind, because I sure as heck don't. Ah, uh, cup of coffee. A decent kind of coffee. Hmm, <laughs> yeah, I bet. Some guys... Probably treat you a little better than a mascot. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah, that's the truth. Yeah, I've been having a good time. Yeah, well, that kind of that uh, peaks a teacher instinct in me. Because if you're better, then you have the ability to push other folks to get better. So, in, instead of just being brilliant yourself, you can uh, better the life of so many others. So. this one. Strength. Yeah, that's pretty much as uh, how I think of uh, as well. So it's not like I'm going to pose you in a relationship or anything in here. Yeah. 
up, dude? Hey there. <laughs> yep, we are definitely. Oh! <laughs> uh, I really hope that your Yukari is feeling up to it. Yeah, I know. Yep, I knew that as well. Hmm. Interesting bit of information that. And yeah, I'm still feeling good. And uh, let's check on people's status. Ah, A crud. Tired from the word go. I wonder if there's anything I can do about that. Because honestly, I'd really love to go to the Tartarus right now. Let's uh, wash up. I've been doing that lately at all. that at all, but hey, good to know. I think I may actually need to head to a Tartarus even though Yukari isn't feeling 100%, because I want, it's um, it's already 7th and uh, the deadline for that last task is 8th, and uh, yeah, I definitely want to give that a go, so Go to the Tartarus and uh, hope we do all right. Even though Yukari is feeling tired immediately. So that's it for this episode. Join me again next time for some more Tartarus exploration. See you later. Bye for now.